Good morning, Audacious Church, uh, or good afternoon, or for those feeling particularly adventurous, good evening. Uh, whenever it is you decide to watch this devotion, it is great to have you with us this morning. Uh, my name's Alex, I have the privilege of attending our Manchester Central Campus here at Audacious. Uh, and this morning, I'm just going to spend a few moments in God's Word, you know, chatting about uh, God's power. So if you've got your Bible with us, turn with uh, me to Ephesians uh, 1, 19 to 21. I'm reading from the New International Version, but whether you've got the message or the passion, doesn't matter. It's all still God's Word. So here we go. Uh, and here's what it says. And in his incomparably great power for us who believe, that power is the same as the mighty strength he exerted when he raised Christ from the dead and seated him at his right hand in the heavenly realms. For far above all rule and authority, power and dominion, and every name that is invoked, not only in the present age, but also in the one to come. Wow, what an amazing verse that is for us to kind of kick this devotion off with. And uh, that verse kind of got me thinking about how crazy it is in my life, how much time I spend putting things on charge, whether it's my phone that I'm using to record this devotion, whether, whether it's the laptop that's got my notes on, or whether it's myself at times. Uh, we all have things in our lives that we continuously seem to have to recharge and uh, put uh, power into in order to get the best uh, result out of them. We all know uh, when we're kind of having those days where the phone batteries died, when we just need it, when we need to get that text sent and we need to get the phone call done and then bang, your phone's died and it's not used for it, uh, useful for its purpose anymore. Uh, and that is... Uh, a consistent pattern that we find across our day-to-day -day lives that things in our life we need to charge up otherwise they're going to run out of power and ultimately become useless to us but what this verse highlights and my days i'm grateful for it is that god's power never dwindles it never dies it's the same as it was when he raised christ from the dead and that same power uh, is available to us every single day that same exact power it's not been diluted it's not been uh compromise not it's not gone away over time like a phone battery does it's still exactly the same and on this church that's something that we can be thankful for today and actually uh use in our everyday lives uh because at times i don't know about you uh but being honest there have been times where i tried to do things in my own strength time uh, there have been times where uh, i've been going through a season that's a bit rough a bit tough uh and i've tried to take it all on myself and tried to uh you know do everything in my own strength and the thing is with that is that I'm a bit like a phone battery. I dwindle over time. There'll be seasons where I can 100%, and then a few days later, after that consistent effort of trying to do things on my own, I can be a bit like a flat phone battery. Still looking okay, still looking like a phone, still looking like a functioning person, but on the inside, I've got nothing left to give. My battery's flat and I need recharging. But if we rely on God's power and God's strength, Audacious Church, we can be people who are constantly full of energy, full of zeal, full of that attitude, full of that grit to get up and go and achieve whatever it is that God's called us to do for that day. So let that be your encouragement for this morning, Audacious Church, or whatever you know it is you're facing in this day. Uh, don't do things in your own strength. Know that the Holy Spirit is with you and has equipped you and you have the same power that rose Christ from the dead with you in your everyday life. So I'm just going to take a moment to pray uh, and then we're going to go about our days. Uh, so yeah, Heavenly Father, we thank you that you are with us in every season of our lives. There isn't a day that's gone by that you've abandoned us or there isn't, a, there isn't a moment in our lives where we can't look to you to draw strength from. So I pray right now for everyone listening to this devotion, wherever they are, whatever they're facing, I pray that you'll be just the God who is with them, Emmanuel, God with us, and uh, just speak strength into them, make them, help them to realise that they don't need to fight battles in their own strength, Lord, for you are there with them. Uh, and your power is the same today as it was when it rose Christ from the dead. It's not going to dwindle. It's not going to go away. It is steadfast and it is eternal. And we thank you for that today. And everyone watching this said, Amen. Well, Audacious Church, I, it has been a privilege to share with you this morning. I uh, hope you've taken a little bit of something away from that uh, today. Uh, and yeah, God bless. Have a great day. See you later.